rugged plateaus, foamy waterfalls, open woodlands and vast grasslands make up the dry deciduous landscape of the Panna Tiger Reserve. At first, what seems like a rocky, unforgiving landscape is a secure abode for many. Temperatures drop as low as 5 degrees Celsius in the winter and soar to 45 degrees in the summer. But it is these extreme conditions that make Panna ideal for many. With a star cast of big cats and other predators, the wild theatre thrives in every season. It's barely above zero degrees and a thick fog engulfs the forest. The sambars tussle to stay warm. Cold-blooded reptiles bask in the sun. They need the heat to survive the winter. The misty grasslands are excellent hideouts for cheetals. With newborns in tow, they are alert at all times. Survival is tough, but there is safety in numbers. However, these very numbers make them easy targets for the big cat. The winter mist gives way to spring, a season of abundance. Fresh buds bloom and lush green grass takes over the forest. The generous Indian plum throws a feast. From bulbuls to bears, all rejoice in springtime freshness. But spring is short-lived. Soon, the scorching summer takes over. As temperatures soar, water turns scarce. The Ken River is a lifeline in the lean months, ensuring ample water for Panna's inhabitants. While most try to escape the heat, the Nilgai and Chinkara thrive. These hardy survivors can go for weeks without water. They even blend in with the dry summer colours. But the golden grass is also a cover for predators. Monsoon showers provide relief to the parched land. Streams cut through rocks, leaving behind brimming water holes. And there's plenty of food for everyone. Life flourishes in Panna all year round. A mix of seasons ensure a healthy, thriving prey base. Making the forest a great home for big cats. 
There was a time when Panna Tiger Reserve was about to lose its entire tiger population. With conservation efforts and the forest's resilience, the tigers have made a roaring comeback. It remains one of India's most successful conservation stories. Can we now ensure that this gem of the central Indian highlands remains unharmed? <laughs>